Hi everyone, so today I have a haul and I also have some Gabby goodness. So, um, yeah, let's just get on with the haul. I went to Rite Aid and MAC. So let's just get on with it because I have to do packing because um, I'm leaving tomorrow. But I really wanted to make this video. So, yeah, here we go from Rite Aid. I got another one of the Sally Hansen Comfort Shine Lip Glazes in Fresh Mixed Berry because I already have Fresh Watermelon, but I really like that one and I wanted to try a different color. And it, it's just clear, but it just, it's really pretty. It gives you a little light tint. So I really like that. It's really lightweight and it's cute too. Most of the stuff I got, right, it was just random stuff, so. Okay, one minute. Then I got, um, Smackers Lip Frosting. Oh, and this was $6.29. Smackers Lip Frosting in whipped vanilla this was $2.95 it's brand new then another new item from the smackers is their color kiss it's like uh, one of their liquid lip smackers but it has a little bit of color it's in melon kiss both of them so that'll be cute to try out and if you guys want a review on any of these things leave a comment below Next, um, I got a Wet n Wild eyeshadow, which was $1.99, and, oops, this was $3.95, by the way, cream, $2.51, and these are so pigmented, just like the Sandcastle palette, look at that, very pretty, so that was $1.99, then, I got a Wet n Wild lip gloss, Mega Brilliant, um, in $5.91. I forgot what it's called, but it's a really pretty sparkly lip gloss. Look how many, like, glitters are in there. Very pretty. Oh, and I did my nails. Brittany, you were the first to know on AIM. <laughs> but, um, this is, um, Laguna Beach by Sephora by OPI. And a lot of you guys ask me what the difference is between Sephora by OPI and OPI. I really don't know. I think Sephora just has to have their own version of everything. So I guess that's just their, you know, signature nail polish. Then, last and certainly not least, I got another one of... I got another one of the Maybelline Cool Effects Cooling Shadow Liners. This one reminds me of Gentle Lentil Shade Steak by MAC. I had that, but in dried out. But this is like much like it, except it's much creamier. This is in On the Rocks. So, it's a creamy milk chocolate. Then, from MAC, I just got two things. Oh, three things, sorry. I wanted to get one color eyeshadow that's like neutral that I could wear all the time because I'm slowly hitting pan on all the ones in my MAC quad. So I wanted to try a kind of semi-medium dark kind of color that I can wear every day in the crease. So I picked up Soft Brown. It's a matte finish. It's a really pretty eyeshadow and I'm very excited because I was experimenting with this and I really want to try it in the crease with like shroom on the lid or um naked lunch or something or even and then this as a highlight cream by wet n wild because i think that would just be super pretty and i really just want to bring a few eyeshadows for my trip to virginia tomorrow um because i'm going to bring the sephora palette but there's really not that many eyeshadows that i would wear every single day so I really just want to have some classics that I'll bring with me because I think my mom's bringing her palette because she got one too because we had a lot of points in our card. So I'm probably going to use her palette most of the time. So I really just want to have my own like classic colors. So soft brown. Then, as you guys know, I really like the lip conditioner sticks that come in the little lipstick tube. 
and I showed you guys in my review for the MAC lip treatment um, how small it was. It was like a little stub. So I went to get another one and the lady who was working, Brandy, if you're watching this, hey, um, she was like, oh, have you been using it a lot? And I said, well, kind of. I mean, I'm basically done with it. She said, oh, because it's actually an abrasive kind of lip treatment. I was like, really? It feels really soft on my lips. She's like, yes, but it can exfoliate your lips too much. So that's something to keep in mind. Don't keep on buying it like I was because I didn't know that it was doing that to my lips. So I decided to go with this one. She recommended it's the lip conditioner, but it's in a little squeezy tube, just like a lip gelée. And this reminds me a lot of the Seal Bigelow like little chapstick thingy where you squeeze it out, especially because of the color. It smells just like the vanilla, like any MAC thing. But that vanilla reminded me of the Seal Bigelow. I think it's the same exact thing. Honestly, I really do. But they stopped selling the Seal Bigelow vanilla one at my Bath & Body Works, so I couldn't get that anymore. But yeah, hold on. Let me check my time. Okay. So there's still time for some Gabby goodness. So this is my last video before I head over to Virginia. And um, just a reminder, all the people that won the contest, make sure to message me. Um, my contest video should be up by now my contest winners video should be up by now so check that out if you haven't already because you could miss out on some free mac products so remember just send me a wish and your address and i will ship it off to you and i will keep you posted i'll like message you saying i just picked up the product and i just sent it and like keep you guys posted like a ups man so yeah and um another thing i will probably not be able to go to mac again until after i get back from a vacation so i'll be gone i'll be back sunday night so i will see you guys then and um so i'll probably have to buy the mac stuff in two weeks i didn't get it today when i went to mac because all of you didn't message me yet so i didn't want to like i like um i don't know i would like I, well, first of all, I wanted it to be a quick trip because I just wanted to get necessities for my trip for Virginia. I didn't want to spend loads and loads of money, so I just got... Oh, sorry! Wait! Oh my gosh, there's one more thing that I got from MAC. I got a lipstick, and it's a satin in faux, F-A-U-X. And I love this. Phew! Oh, bless me. Also, I was hiccuping the whole day today. That's annoying. But anyway, it's a really pretty dark pink color. I'm wearing it now. I don't know if you can tell. It's satin. <laughs> Sheesh, it's not even May anymore. There aren't even May flowers. But yeah, it's a pretty lipstick. So anyway, as I was saying, I didn't want to buy a ton of stuff for MAC, just the necessities. And um, so I will definitely get those in maybe two weeks, so wait up for that. Make sure to message me with your address and all that. If you haven't already, just to remind you guys, I don't want any of you guys to miss out on it. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my Gabby goodness, my first Gabby goodness. So, yeah, so thank you guys for watching, and have a great day, and be good while I'm gone. Okay, <laughs> bye. Oh, my gosh. Okay, be good while I'm gone. Ciao. <laughs>